Hi, I'm Dustin Abbott, and I'm here today to talk to you about one of my favorite things when it comes to the accessories that make life as a photographer easier. I'm talking about a harness carrying system, and in this case, the cotton carrier. I've got uh, a couple of main applications that I use something like this for. The first of all is the fact that uh, when I'm carrying a big telephoto out doing a review, and right now I just have a 70 to 200 attached here, but if I'm out doing a super telephoto review, uh, it can be a, a lot of work, or even just out shooting with one, it can be a lot of work to pack that around all the time. And so being able to distribute the weight um, from a harness system is huge because something like this, it goes around and distributes the weight, keeps it up high to where it's across your the back the part of your back and your shoulders rather than just bearing down on one particular area as a result i can uh, shoot for hours and hike around with a lens and not really be bothered by the weight the other application is how i'm set up right now because while you can get the cotton carrier in just a one lens kind of chest harness setup like this you can also get a uh, an additional holster as i've got here to carry a second camera and, and it kind of just uh, piggybacks onto the same thing with the holster on the side. And so this is my configuration when I shoot a wedding or an event. And uh, I don't want to be switching lenses. And so I tend to have one body with a 24 to 70 f2.8 set up and ready to go. So I can just jump up, be ready to shoot there. And then I'll carry a 70 to 200. Um, in the main harness here, and so it's ready to go for when I want a, a longer perspective. And so between that configuration, I can have, you know, large f2.8 uh, zooms uh, that will cover pretty much everything I need to shoot in a typical wedding setting right there on me. And of course, if you have ever shot a wedding uh, before, it's often an eight to 10 hour day, and so it can be physically fatiguing. And so if you have a place that to, to can conveniently put your gear, it not only saves you the, the weight of distributing it all and makes it much easier, less physically fatiguing, it also means that you're much, much less likely to set a camera down somewhere and waste valuable minutes, you know, while the sun is fading or there's pressure on your time clock looking for your gear. And so it's great to have it right here. Systems like this, the cotton carrier is very effective, and I actually use this all the time when this is my day off. And so what I do on my day off is I grab cameras and I head off into the woods. And I love to hike and take photos, and you know, often I incorporate that right into my review process. And so uh, this is the way that I go out. I, I throw a couple of cameras, often bodies, onto uh, my harness system like this, and that way I can hike. My hands are free, and in fact, I've even thrown on here on the side, I've got a third lens that I wanted to shoot with today, just in a, a little lens case that's just put onto the strap system on the sides. And so something like this makes a huge difference um, in carrying gear. And unlike carrying a backpack or something, it's uh, the thing that I like the most is that while I can carry a lot in a backpack, the disadvantage is, is that when I want to actually go to shoot, um, it can be, you know, somewhat of a minor ordeal to take the backpack off, to pull the camera out, load it all back up, put the backpack back on. Uh, carrying something like this, I can just grab whatever I want to shoot and, you know, in just a, a second be ready to shoot. And thus it makes it a much more organic shooting process for me. And so um, this is the way that I like to do it. And, and one other uh, kind of neat touch here, and, and I'm gonna detail a few other pieces here when we get a little bit closer, but um, there are of course safety straps. And so, you know, should something come loose, you have a, a strap there that's going to catch um, your gear. And also it has a locking system. You'll see that I'm going in kind of, uh, down and then to the side and that uh, means that right now it's locked and so it can't come out and so that's a nice uh, safety feature the other thing that is uh, kind of clever about this design is that if you're carrying a big telephoto there's an additional strap that you could put over the top to help to hold it in place and so that is is nice also there's a pouch built in right here that has a, uh, a rain cover and so you have that handy. You do One thing I will say on that note is you wanna keep that folded in nice and flat because if this pouch down here is bulging, it can uh, interfere. You noticed even the way I had it before, sometimes there's a little extra friction on the body. I mean, that can kind of impede your getting it in and out. So you wanna make sure that that's nice and flat. 
So as you can see, even for carrying a uh, bigger lens like the 100 to 400 millimeter um, f4.5 to 5.6 LIS Mark II, um, it, it's very easy to bring this along and to have that weight distributed to where it isn't um, really pulling on you at all and so you can carry this for long periods of time. Now it's not to say that everything is perfect with a cotton carrier. There's a couple of little design issues that I, I would like to detail. One of those is that to mount on the actual individual lugs that go into the strap, it requires an Allen key, which is great if you have an Allen key on hand, but um, I've already run into a situation where for whatever reason I hadn't I neglected to bring it along and I was out and you know it's not like you can just throw a, a key you know a car key or something to tighten up something where if you didn't have a screwdriver with an allen key you really kind of need something specific to fit into there and so I think I would have preferred something with even just a slot on it to where you could use a coin or a uh, you know a key in a kind of a, a crises type situation um, you know to help with that I do often I'll use the pouch that is included here that I will actually store an extra Allen key in there. And so I have it now in emergency situations. And if I'm actually not using the you know, two cameras and I have the additional lug, I'll uh, keep that stored in there as well. One other thing is that while I don't find it difficult to get in and out of the cotton carrier, once you have it set up, and there's, there's a lot of range of adjustments, so once you have it set up, it, it's, it's easy to take on and off. Um, but the, the one downside is that it's the first time you put it on and you're trying to adjust it to your body type, or of course, when I go to adjust when I'm going to be wearing like a thick coat in the winter, um, I'll have to make some adjustments. And it, it's kind of hard to do that by yourself. You really kind of need someone else else to do some of the back and shoulder adjustments the first time around to get it right and uh, and specifically on the back where uh, these kind of go through here you really need someone to kind of get a sense of where you are I don't actually have them balanced right now because I typically wear the second camera on the the left side I actually have it pulled up just a little bit higher on the right side to accommodate for that and so that it will balance out. And so you might just find that the first time that you use it or if you're setting it up in a new situation, you may need to have someone else help you in getting the harness system set up. But once you do have it set up, really, it's just a matter of this on this one side, loosening that back strap and uh, ducking in and out of it. A couple other design features I do want to point out is at the back here, there is a, a place to insert an umbrella, and so um, which is kind of a cool feature that you could even use a, a photo umbrella over the top of you to help to shield you um, in a shooting type situation. One other thing to note is that at first I found that the the lugs and putting them in and you know this actual system that at first it, it seemed like it took a lot of uh, kind of precision to get it in and it kind of was a little bit fussy going in and out but you'll find that after you use it a little bit there's a little bit of kind of breaking in and wear to where after a while um, of use it slips in very easily in and out and so it ceases to be an issue so if you find it a little bit kind of clunky at first going in and out just uh, be patient and uh, use it a little bit and um, after you know several weeks of, of use, I've got it all broken into. Everything is moving nicely for it. But I really haven't found anything better yet for carrying um, you know heavy gear when out in the woods or on a shoot. This really distributes the weight very well. If you've just kind of invested in a telephoto glass or you're looking for just a carrying system, if you want to carry more than one camera body, I really recommend uh, the Cotton Carrier Harness System. I'll throw a link to their website and information to it down below. Um, whether you just want a single one or you want the double, it certainly makes a big difference. It's well constructed and it has a huge range of um, kind of adapting it to whatever your body type might be and making sure to get in the optimal condition. I've used others before that weren't as well made as this and they didn't have the same range of adjustment and it's surprising what a difference that can make because if you can get that up in the right place it really helps to distribute the weight in a much better fashion. I'm Dustin Abbott, and I hope this has helped you out today, maybe in your everyday shooting. If you haven't already, you can follow me on social media down below, and there's also linkage to the things that are related to the cotton carrier there. If you haven't already, please click that subscribe button. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.